Will Hideo Kojima ever return to Metal Gear Solid? That's the topic for today's video. It's no secret that Metal Gear Solid is one of the best franchises ever created and that is best credited to its creator of the franchise Hideo Kojima. Konami and Hideo Kojima split back in 2015 shortly after the launch of Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain due to Konami's restructuring of the company and creative differences with Kojima himself. As unfortunate as it sounds, for Kojima he honestly made the best out of a terrible situation not only because he made his own studio where he has complete freedom over his games but where no one can interfere with his ideas but is there a possibility of him returning to the metal gear solid or is it kind of out of the picture at this point well i think the best case scenario is that konami would do is license the franchise off to him but even then i don't think he would even return in today's video we are going to be talking about why this will probably never happen but if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video please drop a like subscribe if you guys are new and let's get on with today's video just a quick side note before i do say anything else i do want to preface that this is only my opinion and i am explaining why there could be a day where konami and kojima rekindle their relationship and make a brand new Metal Gear title. But until this day happens, I think we can all be grateful that we have a remake of Snake Eater on the way. Well, where do we start beside the fact that the Metal Gear Solid series producer is a big fan of Kojima and he would love to work together again and his name is Noriaki Akamura. I probably pronounced that wrong. He is the producer of the Snake Eater remake and he has said in a YouTube live stream, and I'm going to read it now to you. But just speaking for myself personally, I'd like nothing better than to work with Mr. Kojima, the rest of the team again, Akamura said. If that could happen, that would be the dream. But people have moved on to new things and new commitments, and that's just the current reality. We just can't take it for granted that everyone will work with us again or let ourselves be completely dependent on them. And that was from a YouTube live stream. But what we can get from that is that Konami Konami is at least willing to mend things with Kojima, but unfortunately the same can't be said for Kojima and honestly I think it's for the best. Hideo Kojima has honestly moved on from the Metal Gear Solid series and I'm sure as much as he loves this franchise, I think he's overall done with that chapter of his life. He honestly looks like he's very passionate of what he's working on right now, which he currently has a lot on his plate because he's working with three up and coming games that have all been announced by the way. And those games are Death Stranding 2 and Finst, I don't really know how to pronounce that. And also, I don't really know how to say this, it's just OD. So Kojima and his studio are currently working on a lot of projects and unfortunately he and his studio probably does not have the time to really work on anything new besides what they're already working on. But I also do want to bring up the possibility isn't out of the window. I'm pretty sure whether if Metal Gear Solid 3 is a success or not, Konami will continue the series without Kojima. But even that is a scary thought because they already took a try with this and it did not go great. And I'm obviously talking about Metal Gear Survive which was not received well and the last thing I want for this is to happen again. I do think the most likely future for the Metal Gear Solid series is after the Snake Eater remake we will be getting new mainline games. I hope you guys did enjoy this video and if you guys did consider leaving a like and subscribe for more content like this and with all that being said that's going to wrap up today's video. Take care and have a great rest of your day.